you really don't need, so I don't recommend wasting fire on that. Anytime you use the fire in your bottle, you just fill it back up with one of those blue uh, flames there. We're about to go to another one actually right now, so. <laughs> Oh god. Alright, so. Here's one of them right here. These little red, uh. Walls right here. You can. What? What the fuck? Really? Okay, I thought I fucking. Got it, but apparently not. Um. Okay, I guess you gotta stand right in front of it. Alright, now. Look, I thought that thing was gonna hit me if I stood right in front of it, but I guess it doesn't reach out quite that far. Oh shit, look at Alright, now. Take that, thank you. I don't remember what's in here right off the top of my head. Probably was a waste. Yeah. This is a compass, never mind. You don't have to do that. It's really stupid. Yeah, fuck you, bat. Okay. I come over here. We got two awesome items. A gold sculpture right there. And a piece of heart. Yay. <laughs> Okay, now, time to fill up the bottles again. No, huh? I got one more, I do believe. Yep. Alright, now we got that, let's get the fuck out of here. So come over here to this other one that looks red and drop a fire on it. Or a flame, whatever. I guess blue fire doesn't need oxygen to, to breathe. That's cool. Yeah, I recommend you kill all these bats before you do anything because... Ooh, that was close. Alright, so the goal here is to... Move this block around in a fashion that will allow you to get all these rupees. Yeah, silver rupees. Yeah, okay, whatever. Yeah, if you're in air and then you hit the B button, then you'll do a jump attack, like so. But yeah, yeah, um... Push it over here. If, by the way, if you push it over into the, um... The holes over there, it'll respawn, so... Just keep that in mind. Okay. 
so we'll need that now. Just push it over into the corner. And there we are. And push it over here. Ah, oh, then. Now oh, that's where we want to go. Only after we fill our um, bottles up, however. Um, actually, at this point, we only need two flames. If done correctly, of course. Yes, so we only have. Okay. So you need at least two on you right now. And don't lose them. Okay, so. Move over here, careful not to go off the edge, that would suck. No, 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 no. Now, straight across. What the fuck? I wasn't even near it. What the hell? Alright, you're going down, buddy. Alright, now then. The only way to get through here is to hit towards this middle one, the small one. Just like I'm standing here. Get out your flame. Should burn all three of them. so fast. And that's all it takes, folks. Okay. I said, make sure before you leave this place, you have at least one flame in your deal, in your bottles. Alright, I'm going to open this up. Okay, so we got the iron boots. Guess we do meet again.
Serenade of water. You'll hear this song again in uh, Twilight Princess. Alrighty. So, you'll see this little pool of water here. Let's go ahead and jump on down. And then, uh, use your iron boots to get under there. the door and keep going. Alright. And take them off. Alrighty then. Alright, so what you wanna what you're gonna wanna do now is come over here. And uh let's see. Just stand as close as this guy look as close to him as possible and then use your last flame on him. Step back over here. I'm gonna put that away. Yes, yes, you have. So now, we can go underwater for pretty much unlimited amount of time without having to worry about breathing. Just by wearing that tunic. Isn't that awesome? So yeah, use that with a <sighs> combination of uh, the iron boots to hold you down. You can be underwater. Um, that being said, let's go ahead and use that combination. Durka, durka, durka. Uh huh. Another art piece. Yeah. Now, just unequip your boots, and away you'll go. I guess it won't let me go first person. Okay, so we're gonna wanna go over here. I do believe. Basically, I think the only thing we have left to do is just go to the next dungeon, really. Um, I'll just use the, um,. This looks like good, a good stopping place for now, actually. Um, yeah. Well, I'll show you, actually, before I stop. 
how to get in. Oh, excuse me. All right, so you jump down here. This is Lake Hylia, in case you hadn't noticed. But the water's pretty much gone, with the exception of this. Now use your iron boots. Now the only weapon you can use when, while you're underwater like this is your hookshot, so keep that in mind. To the next dungeon. <sighs> this dungeon is really annoying. Um, it's probably the most annoying one out of all of them, but it's not too bad, I guess. I mean, it's not. I, I get through it no problem, but there's just a lot of backtracking and running around and shit in this one so anyway I'm gonna stop here I'm kinda low on time and people are trying to talk to me so I think it's a good place to stop so I'm gonna go ahead and save and we will continue this later folks um, thanks for watching everyone and uh, I'll see you next time bye